Hey guys, hope everyone do, is doing well today. I've decided to put together some social media videos related to the orders that are coming out in Washington, D.C. I've been getting a lot of questions from some of you on what is allowed right now, what can happen if I go outside. Um, and there's a lot of questions about everything right now and there's a lot of fear, so I thought maybe I could give back a little bit to you and the community by helping to provide some clarity. So as you know, a shelter in place has been put into effect um, today, April 1st, and that this order actually has some criminal teeth, meaning if you violate the order, you can be arrested and charged with a criminal misdemeanor uh, that carries up to 90 days in jail and or up to a $5,000 fine. Now, there are some exceptions to this rule, but let, let me first you know, get into that a little bit. Essentially, this order is saying, hey, you have to stay inside. If you come outside, you can be arrested. However, there's a very uh, big exception to this for several things. Uh, obviously, we know about essential travel, essential business. And the other one is allowable recreational activities. Again, allowable recreational activities. And that's one that I'm going to focus on right now. Um, essentially, the order is allowing us to go outside, saying you can go outside. However, there's some, there is uh, some very strict guidelines on this. And number one, you have to adhere to social um, distancing, meaning that when you go outside, you have to stay six feet away from another person and there can be no physical contact. Also, you can only be with someone that you reside with, meaning that if you go outside, it can, you are allowed to go on a walk, you can go on a hike, you can go uh, golfing, you can play tennis, um, but, and you can do this alone or you can do this with an individual or individuals you reside with However, you still have to maintain social distancing, which again means six feet away from each other and no physical contact. Now, uh, what doesn't this allow for? It doesn't allow for uh, us going out on, on tender dates, something that my girlfriend would absolutely kill me if I did. Anyways, um, uh, we can't go on tender dates, no bumble dates. We can't go out with our best friend who lives across the street or meet up with the neighbor. I um, mean, even, you know, even if we're adhering to six feet, um, the order is strictly limited to those we reside with. Now, uh, there's, unfortunately, I think this order came out really fast. It's kind of a sloppy order, in my opinion, because there is no exceptions for children, for the disabled, uh, for the elderly. I Meaning you, you could potentially be arrested right now for holding your two-year-old's hand, or in my case, my four-year-old's hand as we cross the street, uh, for pushing someone in a wheelchair. Uh, you could actually be arrested for that because right now uh, the order is limited to that six feet and there's no exceptions built into it. Um, I, w I wasn't really sure how the police were going to be acting on this and whether or not we were going to see arrests happening. I will say that today some information has come up that there has been an order uh, made to the police uh, and they've been ordered to make arrests on this. So. I wanted to make sure you guys all got the information out. I, I got the information out to you guys. I, I know there's a lot of questions. Um, please stay safe, uh, stay healthy. If you have any questions about this at all, contact me. You can contact my firm, Scrafana Law. Uh, we are here really right now in this time period to just answer questions, um, provide information in this kind of like crazy, crazy world we're in. And I, I would love to be here. Um, text me if you know my number. Uh, DM me, call me. I'm here for any information. This is going to be something that's going to be changing every day. The new orders are probably going to be coming in every day, and we're going to try to get it out, uh, get out information back to you as quickly as possible. Please don't get arrested. Um, call me. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Let's get this social distancing thing down, and let's get back outside. Um, let's let's get back to enjoying life, barbecuing, and hanging out. But we need to we need to jump on this now and take care of this. All right, guys. Stay healthy. Take care.